Well, hello, it's Nancy today. I guess you know that just by looking at me. But so we're out here kayaking today and there's this island up here. We're gonna go around it. I'm with my friend. There's a few cottages on here, hello, very everybody. few. So we're heading that way. I have this cool map. It's a topographical map and it's called Canada and it's it shows all these islands in this lake I'm not going to tell you what the name of the lake is because this is where I live I don't want everybody to know just exactly where I live but um, so there's this island here which I guess stretches away from us according to the map There, on that side there's a little cove and over there there's islands and you can kind of tell that they're islands because of the the top of the trees the um if I do it this way it'll make it look easier for you so this island we can go right around right yes on the left is very wide like you see and on the right is a uh, is narrow it's a channel. I don't know if it's got weeds in the channel. It's, that's a possibility. Do you want to go around this side of it? Yeah. I mean this side of here? Oh, that, you want to go there? Okay, well, whatever. Just in case the weeds go all the way across. Okay. And we're already on this side. Look at that lovely little house up there. It looks abandoned. Regarding me is not necessarily there, but your name they wouldn't have, so she could actually maybe find you. Mm, that's a good idea. Well, it's worth a try. Anyway. Yeah. And then I think of her. Maybe she's guiding all the foster kids out, helping them to get them escape from that, because she knows what good is. These skinny trees are. Um, the dark ones are black spruce. I love black spruce. They're just such a Canadian tree. They're just such a northern. They're not black though. Why do they call it black? Well, they're very dark. I like the tree in front of my house. It's blue, isn't it? A blue spruce? Yeah. Yeah. I think those have to be planted, if I'm not mistaken. It's really, it's really. It's really nice because it, it, um, it blocks my window, so you know, if I don't have a curtain, I can see it. Yeah. And I planted a new tree now, the lilac. And uh, in a couple of weeks, that'll be good. That'll block the rest of my window, and that'll be fine. And then you'll be looking right out into the woods. Oh, there's a lot of um, a lot of clam shells on the ground here. This is where the otters come, and they eat the clams. There's boats in it, so it's probably not as clean as some. What's in it? Oh, the boats? The boats. Oh, 
But I think it's, you know, this is a huge body of water and it's moving. So I think it cleans itself, yeah. personally. The pickerel weed is in bloom here too. There's rushes here. Isn't it? Oh, thank you, dear. videoing me and gotcha. I'm videoing you. Are you? <laughs> I was just taking pictures. <laughs> oh, so We're in heaven. We are. like this island is losing its trees. Yeah, you're right. Well, it must have been maybe because it really got filled up. And then it emptied again. But I guess it was I probably very, very high this spring. Yeah. For a long time. I guess there was a something here. We had a, we had a boat launch. Drag it back with us and put it at that Clyde River. <laughs> I have a way of making a dock. Mm -hmm. I take logs, like cedar post ends. Yeah. They're a couple feet long. And I line them up and put a board on top. And then the whole thing floats. So I've got some docks in my ponds for now. Wow. Out of your pond? Uh, no, there's not big fish in them. Okay. They're just little tiny things. But now. then, what happens if they don't get big? Then they die? Oh, well, I don't know. I think that they are the turtles eat the fish. Oh, okay. I don't know what the frogs eat. They just eat the bugs, I guess. Because I know that they say, you know, when you have. A, oh, and the otters would eat the fish. Okay. When you have um, a fish bowl, they'll only get as big as your fish bowl. Yeah. And then if you put them in a pond, then they get bigger. And yeah, it would be fun to put goldfish in it. It's deep enough in the middle. There's a 10 foot deep place. So then they could go underneath and be okay. Yeah. Really? Well, that's good. Yeah. I didn't know that they could live in the water. Yeah, if, you're, if they're down below the water. You know, the little the... Wow. 
This is a great camera. It's got a 70x zoom. So like your binoculars, if they're 10, they're really good, but they shake a lot. So this has a stabilizer on it, and so you can get things really close. Like I could, if there were a bird up in the top of that tree, I could zoom in and you could see him chewing. Hmm. Yeah, it is. Hear the morning dove. I love the sound of a morning dove. I know. It's beautiful, eh? So I wonder where the river is. I guess, I think it goes that way. Let's see what this shows. Yeah, so I guess it goes that way up there. So we could go that way. Yeah. It goes into another bay. Through it's it narrows and there's some islands to go around and then it goes into a bay. And then way at the end of that little bay, which is also quite near. That would be cool if we can go to the dam and back. Um, it's on the other side of the bay. This way? Yes. No. No, it's not it's fast. Like the dam in Morn Heights is like nothing. Well, this would have big buoys all along it to make us safe. But we won't go in it. Yeah, and Lanark, that's what they have the buoys over. I can hear the loon, but I don't see him. That way. Oh, is that right? He's behind us. That way. I was thinking maybe he's afraid of those two coming again. Now that, eagles. now there are eagles here. We have bald eagles. That's not, it might be an osprey. Yeah. We have lots of ospreys. Right? Yes. Do you call it osprey? Yes. I never say that. O-S-P-R-E-Y. Uh oh, it's also known as a fish hawk or fish eagle. Oh no, it's stinking! Don't sink! When I was kayak, or we were rafting in the Arctic, um, or in, no, not the Arctic, up by Juneau, Alaska, and my hat fell in the water, and when I put it on my head, the water burned. It was so cold. Wow. It was all glacial runoff, so the water was white. Wow. It was full of glacial silt. That was in the, the Taku.
I find when you're out in the middle like this, it's really hard to see which way the river goes. But we go that way, right? Yeah, let me just check it again. See where we are here. Yeah, so we go up around this. Oh, I see an opening there. Go further up first, I think. I Are don't. Going the right way? No, I think we go. St we go straight up. Well, let me. Let me just. You think we go this way? Yeah, I think we might. I think this island tapers off, and then there's a little bay beside it. No. Um, we're going to go to the right, but I'm not sure if we go to the right up ahead past that little tiny rock, that rock island. Let me check this again. It looks open there. So. Yes, that's right. Yes. So we do. We go this way. And then that over there is a little point. A little what? A point. It's a little point that we're going to go over here. Let's see if that rock is on here. Yeah, that's just a bay up ahead, up there. And so the whole main thing turns turns here. Okay. have gone around the other side? Well, it does. On the map it shows that there's a channel. As we get further, we'll be able to look down it, I think, and see if it's weedy. Oh yeah, it looks pretty good down there. Need to use a map. I think that's so cool. Yes, I love it. All this technology stuff. And I have my phone set to um, airplane mode so it doesn't use all its power trying to search for. Oh, that's a good idea. Yeah. Let's try that. Yeah, it's very, very. Uh, it, it'll stay at 1% for hours. It's on airplane mode. Um, is yours iPod or Android? Android. I, I don't know how to work those. Okay. Probably go into settings.
Oh yeah, that's beautiful through there. It's probably under connection. Oh, that's it. Flight mode. The water is so still here. I saw a pair of loons up here somewhere. I don't see them now. Oh, there they are, right there. Oh, they've gone under. I love it when you stop, because then I get to stop. <laughs> oh, that beautiful purple flower. Pickerel weed. I'm so glad it's overcast. Yeah. At least a bit. Stay out and not have to worry about being too hot. Mm hmm. My open bottle makes a wind, a noise with the wind. So the wind is going to push us home. It's good. Oh, I guess it blew me this way while you were taking pictures. I guess it blew us this way yeah. while we were sitting.
asked my brother, I could ask him, I want I told him I wanted to go kayaking. Did you go to his river, which is he's in um uh Almont? Oh yes. Because he doesn't have anything to put his his uh, kayak on. So we could join him and there's a boat dock like walking distance from his house. Oh that's nice. And they there's a really nice area. I mean it goes for a long way. I like so, Almont. And he knows it because it's his river that he's always on. Great. So he could guide us. Okay. That sounds fun. Is he available on a Tuesday or Wednesday? I don't know. But, um, oh, well, he must have, I don't know if he has any more holidays. I'll ask him. I know that he's having problems. He has, um, he has Wait a minute, I'm recording. He has a oh, I, I'm recording. Oh, okay. Anyways, he has some difficulties and he, um, he's trying to get it all resolved and then, but I think it doesn't affect him when he got it. It's so neat to be able to use the map to see which way the river goes. And it's a, it's all a lake now. This next one is a, a bay. Okay. And then we can go through the bay to another spot? I think at the other end of the bay is the dam. So the, the lake we've been in is the biggest lake. This one right here? Yeah. See, I think those are islands there. There's this, a little rock and then... I guess because it's a bay and has a dam, there's not um, there's not a lot of current. Oh yeah, you see this point. You can see right through it see right through it to the bay. This is quite exciting. I've never been up here. Perhaps there's an island in this bay. Here's the clams again. Isn't this pretty? There's no cottages or anything along it. Check the map again. Oh, this is not the bay. This is this is a join between this lake and the bay. And so that's an island. Oh, that's an island back there. this island and then it gets narrow 
and eventually we end up in this other bay, which we're not in yet. There, now I have you. I have my wires hanging out of myself here. see the loons anymore. It would be so cool to see a bear with her cubs on shore. Wouldn't that be neat? And like they wouldn't come in the water and get it. Right? No, because we're not we wouldn't be in between them. You're not a threat. Foxes are out in the day. They have to go find mice for their babies. I watched that one the other day. Was I with you? Just the other day he was talking with me. No. Oh no, he was with Leanne, I think. The, the animals are all very aware of our presence. I can't, I can imagine there's probably 30 deer that have heard us talking and are are wondering just where we are and if we're a danger and this is so pretty in there All the animals in the water can hear us every time I bang my kayak with my paddle. That I echoes. do that when I go under the bridge so that all the birds get out. Oh, yeah. Birdie, birdie in the sky. Why'd you do that in my eye? I'm not sad. I'm not mad. I'm just glad the cows don't fly. <laughs> time of the day is early early morning. I would love to come out here at 5 a.m. and do this while the light is rising. Now is, is, is the sun up at 5? Um, yeah it's light out at 5. It's not up yet but it's it was up. I think it's not now. Darner. I have a big dragonfly on the front of the boat. Oh, nice. He's gone. I zoomed in on him. Maybe that'll be good for your daughter. Well, he's. I wonder how long this is. Okay. 
can't tell what it says. Maybe I should stop and start over. Okay, goodbye.